The majority of wild burros in the United States live in the deserts and mountains of Arizona. Quiet and deliberate, they are beautifully adapted to their surroundings and are some of the largest wild animals to be found in their desert homes. Unlike wild horses that run from intruders, burros tend to size up a situation. It gives us an opportunity to quietly observe. Although protected by the Wild Horse and Burrow Act, they are managed at token levels, far less than the herd sizes needed to guarantee their existence into the next century. The recent National Academies of Science report included cautionary words. Multiple populations, totaling thousands rather than hundreds of individuals, will probably be necessary for long-term viability of the species. Genetic analysis of wild burrow herds finds diversity levels lower than their endangered cousins in Africa. Only one herd comes remotely close to the minimum required for long-term survival, and that is the one targeted for a devastating removal, unless we can convince BLM to reconsider. Over 1,000 burrows call the Black Mountain Herd Management Area home. Scattered over the landscape, these hardy burrow survivors can be difficult to spot and are wary of onlookers. Seventy-five miles long, and 13 miles wide in northwestern Arizona, the Black Mountain area is 1.1 million acres of volcanic mountains and sandy draws east of the Colorado River. It is nearly as large as the state of Delaware. Alone Jenny and her baby forage on brittle sticks and scanty vegetation. Like all burrows, they thrive on very little and eat roughage that is indigestible to their cloven-hooved counterparts. Burrows are accused of competing with other animals, yet new scientific revelations in Arizona show vital ways in which they benefit other wildlife. Trail cam footage shot in August 2015 reveals burrows digging for water with their solid hooves, they are better equipped to dig than cloven-hooved animals, like those seen here, the javelina, mule deer, and desert bighorn sheep. Even coyotes and domestic livestock benefit from the well-digging wild burrows. Burrows are often blamed for destruction of fragile desert habitats when the damage is clearly done by humans. The tracks you see here are not burrow paths, but ATV and motorcycle trails slicing into the desert dunes. Ignoring the real culprits of desert destruction, BLM proposes to remove nearly three quarters of the burrows in Black Mountain leaving a non-viable remnant. Let's fight back for the burrows. The last wild horse or burrow range where management is primarily for wild horses and burrows was designated 25 years ago. It's time for the burrows of Arizona to have a range designated for them and the other wildlife of the Black Mountains. Without protections, a roundup could destroy this last stronghold of the boroughs. Let Arizona's congressional delegation know you want to range for these icons of the desert in their state. Ask them to do the right thing today for the boroughs of the Black Mountains. Stop the roundup. Create an Arizona borough range.